Hello, welcome to the Wreck It Ralph Two. Uh, it's actually called Ralph Breaks the Internet. Wreck It Ralph Two, or is it backwards? I'm not sure. I think it might actually be Ralph Breaks. I think it might actually be Ralph Breaks, Breaks the, the Internet. Internet. Wreck It Ralph Two official official trailer reaction here on Color Circuit. My name is Dylan. Megan. Uh, Digi. Digi. And uh, we Sorry, are operating the camera from up here. Yes, we are doing camera operation <laughs> from right here. Um, and I have not watched this yet. I am very excited because the I've first watched one... this trailer a couple times. I watched it earlier today and I showed it to Cheska earlier. Um, I didn't know it was going to be on camera, but we had somebody who didn't want the first movie spoiled for them and uh, ducked out of this reaction. <laughs> yes. And it's not like a, a huge, there's not like huge no. spoilers in this film. It's a pretty Spoiler typical. Spoiler alert, the two main characters of the first movie are friends. Yay. Yay. Uh, Friendship. Yes. And you'll see that in this trailer anyways. Yeah. Probably. I, I wouldn't have my doubts. So uh, yeah. let's watch this. I hear there's a very fun um, there's a little scene. A lot of fun scene. Okay, cool. I'm, Ooh, I'm really stoked right. about this. Start churning butter Sorry, and put on your church shoes, little sister, because we're about to blast off. Ralph, what is it you're trying to say? We're going to the internet. What? Like this the is intro the most beautiful Valley. miracle I've ever seen. Welcome to the search <laughs> bar. What can I help you find today? Um, Umbrella. Umbridge. Umami. No. Noah's Ark. No doubt. No Nordstrom Rack. <sighs> Ergonomics. Urban Outfitters. Er, cool. I'm pretty sure he's just trying to guess what you're gonna say. My autofill is a touch aggressive today. Let me try. <laughs> Take me to a website that's super intense and really nuts. Oh, I only found I one result. Say, <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, princesses and cartoon characters barf. Hey. Whoa. Oh my God! Oh, you're coming out with Hi. <gasps> Princess too. What kind of Don't princess? Don't you have to uh, shake a Do you bitch. have magic hair? No. Magic hands? No. Do animals talk to you? No. Were you poisoned? No. Cursed? No. Kidnapped, Kidnapped or enslaved? enslaved? No. Are you guys okay? Should I call the police? Do people assume all your problems got solved because a big strong man showed up? Yes. What is up with that? She, she is, is a princess. princess. <laughs> <laughs> Ralph breaks the internet. Shouldn't it be Ralph wrecks the internet? Yeah, since he is wreck it, Ralph. Uh, yeah, but break the internet, it's like a thing. Right, it's just wreck the internet kind of sounds better, doesn't it? Mm, you're not wrong. Oh, my gosh. Uh, that was way more, um... Oh, there we go. That was way more, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Like fourth meta? wall breaking, <laughs> more meta than I yeah. thought it would be, especially compared to the first one, which really mm -hmm. wasn't meta. Yeah. So, well, I mean, the first one had a, it wasn't really meta, but it had a lot of referential. Yes, things. yes. Like a lot of people are upset, like, oh, it's just a bunch of like referential humor and callbacks and De Deadpool meta 2 joke. Easter like, egg style. It's all, it's all de like, you know, and I'm just like, the first movie had a Sonic Says segment in it. Sure, right. Um, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Where they had like Sonic the Hedgehog giving a PSA, like I'm 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 guessing most of the people complaining about this just haven't seen the first movie in a while. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um I'm gonna assume it's like the first movie where they have a whole bunch of really fun, quirky references stuff at the beginning to establish the world, then the plot happens. Okay. Because Wreck It Ralph one, it started with like the villain club thing where they're all sitting around at their their talk group mm -hmm. and um like 15, 20 minutes into the movie, they're set in their own original universe in a game that's not actually a Sure, real yeah. In the first movie, there was a big intersection where you saw all of the characters mm -hmm. kind of uh, yeah. in one place, and then and then they basically yeah. didn't touch it again. Interesting thing about that that I found out is um, there was, like, this huge back and forth with uh, Sega and Nintendo, and each one of them kept trying to get on them for, like, 
uh, those like Bowser and Robotnik were in that scene, mm -hmm. and they kept like asking them to redo the animation so their character was larger. <laughs> So it's That's like, no, no, amazing. Bowser Bowser is taller than Robotnik. B Bowser <laughs> should be bigger. In this scene, we won't let you use Bowser unless you make him bigger. Oh, my God. And then Sega's God. like, no, no, Robotnik is a very tall person. <laughs> I think he'd be bigger than Bowser. That's amazing. <laughs> that makes me very happy yeah. to know that they're that, uh, <laughs> that petty. That petty. Yeah. Uh, what did you think of the trailer? It looks good. I haven't seen the first one. Yes, yes. No. You were one so. of the few people I know that haven't mm -hmm. hasn't seen this movie because – it wasn't as widely popular as other Disney films, yeah. clearly, but it is uh, it is a gem, and it very much stands <laughs> out amongst their animated stuff. And um, it just, I feel like it didn't get a lot of, maybe it came out with at the same time as another like cartoon or something. Sure. I feel like it didn't get a lot of like... Yeah, I don't remember the press being as big. I do remember it being more for like the nerdy game yeah. people. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, I was a nerdy game person, so I feel like I could enjoy it. But I definitely, mm -hmm. I mean, that princess scene, that got to my little six-year-old heart. Cinderella like, breaking a glass <laughs> slipper. I love being it like a vicious Cinderella. <laughs> and like just kind of getting it on like this fairy tale like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. That These was days. weird. I honestly feel like even though they kind of showed what was happening and they've mm -hmm. done this with the other trailers too, like he's going to the internet clearly. Um mm -hmm. I feel like this uh, this whole trailer was pretty much for that. For yeah. that scene. Just, yeah. uh, just to show all you. the Disney princesses. Yeah, like. which if they did it really well. I, it's all self referential, obviously. Yeah. I like that they're Pointing out the fact that, yeah, we know what we do. We're <laughs> Disney. This is how we do they princess didn't have movies. Enough Ariel, though. That's my one yeah. complaint. Oh. I, mean, I have a nice. feeling that all of the princesses are going to get at least a good line. Hopefully. Sure. Like, yeah. Like, and actually, basically, all of the living voice actresses for those characters are coming back for this. Really? So, like, that was the voice actress for, I don't remember her name. Because Mandy the... Moore was, that was Mandy Moore for Tangled, right? Yeah. Uh, that was it. And, and then um, Idina Menzel for Elsa. Uh, and okay. uh, they, they have all of the original voice cast. Jody Benson that are still did a alive. lot of them, I know. So I believe it is just um, Sleeping Beauty. Um, I don't Cinderella actually and Snow White. remember her name. And uh, yeah, and Cinderella and Snow White are new voices. Okay. Okay. Well, yeah. Everybody are... else is the original. That's super cool that they would do. I feel like that. Uh, it, actually, now that I think about it, too, that scene in this trailer is going to market probably to a different demographic mm -hmm. that would have normally seen this movie. Mm -hmm. If there yeah. is if there is such thing as, and there clearly is in marketing, mm -hmm. uh, b our demographic is young boys, our demographic is young girls, yeah. this is clearly grabbing the young girl audience. Mm -hmm. um, and also interesting I to note. Up, oh. The, oh, sorry. Uh, you you first. I've talked a lot. <laughs> I grew up playing like Sega and Nintendo with mm -hmm. my brother, and like we watched Spider Man and Gargoyles, and but that was more to like bond with my brother. Like Disney sure. princesses were for me. Like I could Ralph, I can relate to because like it brings yeah. back. Did your brother memory, reciprocate? But... Did he join you in watching those films? Uh, kind of. I had Beauty and the Beast dolls, and he played the Beast. But okay. then when he got old enough, he like drew a little like crosshairs on my Beast doll and oh. melted their heads, and so it got yeah. a little so he violent. Was an not me. Andy. <laughs> he was the next door neighbor in Toy Story. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, yeah. Sid. Sid. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> but um like the thing is like i find it interesting this disney princess scene came right after a scene where iron man was chased by tie fighters and uh oh. the stormtroopers were chasing down vanellope ah, like okay i see what's going juxtaposition, on juxtaposition like mm -hmm, yeah mm -hmm. i also really like because i remember everybody complaining that like why did they not call it why did they not call it ralph yeah Rex the, the internet and, and they he, knew yeah. immediately i and i bet that wasn't even a reshoot i bet they did that a no, long I, time I, ago i'm 100 percent certain that that was mm. originally in the script sure yes yes like, yes uh yeah which ma which makes the title almost more fun because yeah. they get to play around with it a little yeah. bit um, I so I, I think clearly, or at least in general, we all seem to be pretty excited about this. Yes, yes. I'd give that trailer an oh, eight yeah. out of ten, maybe. Yeah, like yeah the 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 Suspiria trailer was definitely the best trailer <laughs> we've watched. From yeah, a uh, yeah. If you're but, interested, we do a lot of other trailers. Yeah. Suspiria is one of them. Yeah, but I mean. Cinderella just broke a shoe in a prison <laughs> shoe. Like, that's the thing. Cinderella that's got so, a shank a bitch. He can't yeah, top that. Cindy <laughs> got a shank a bitch. Uh, like, yeah, that is uh, seeing the princesses in a different light. And I can't believe yeah. they shoved every princess in that room. Yeah. Every single mm -hmm. one. It was pretty awesome. I don't, I mean, I, I was. Even the controversial ones like Pocahontas. And, right. Oh, wait, was Mulan in there? Yes, I, Mulan and Merida and um, Moana. Yeah, oh, I saw Moana. Yeah, Wait. jeez, mm -hmm. it's amazing. It's because Disney Princess is a marketing brand that has nothing to do with them actually being princesses. Mm, um, which, okay. They have a very strict set of criteria for being a Disney princess. Okay. 
Um, yes, I know I this Disney many because times I looked that. it up, <laughs> and by their own definitions, Kuzco could qualify as a Disney princess. Really? That's kind there of cool. is not an actual bullet point on there that they have to be a woman. Oh, ah, okay. Kuzco, okay. best Disney princess. You heard it here first. <laughs> Uh, a little bias, I think. Uh, he's, that's a great movie, though. I love is. that movie. Um, so, yeah, what do you think of Ralph Breaks the Internet, Wreck-It Ralph uh, 2 official trailer? Please let us know in the comments below. And uh, we are live almost every day on twitch.tv slash callers to get live for more film and television news. We drop those on uh, a, a longer extended version of this show on Sundays and um, throughout the week we have more film game and comedy related content um, please like subscribe share all the verbs and uh, we love you guys I think is how we'll end that we'll end there yeah. and we love Disney princesses so bye bye <laughs> <laughs>